Hey, ladies and gentlemen, friends and fans, welcome on back to the newest installment of Lee Steven Singer on the YouTube channel. Now, I hope many of you saw my little uh, sneak preview via a pic I put out on social media, giving you a heads up on what this new installment is going to be. That's right. Uh, and uh, for those of you that are uh, new, brand new to our broadcast, come on in. Take a seat, pop a squat, however you want to put it. But as soon as you click that link for our YouTube channel, you are family. So welcome on in. Now, getting back to this newest installment. This newest installment is called The Songwriter's Corner. All right. So it's going to be a little more relaxed, a little more casual. Uh, what we're looking to do is we want to do something new, uh, create something new. As always, as artists, we should be always creating something new. Um, so I've been sharing more and more of uh, my original songs. And I thank you, the fans and friends, because I want you to understand this. You, are so, you, the audience, are so vital to us artists because when we step out and we try something new, we step out of the shadows as a songwriter like I'm doing, you embolden us to do that. You embolden us to surge forward. You embolden us to keep chasing the dream and uh, keep surging forward. So I thank you for that uh, massive love. Also, I want to um, say that I've been lucky enough to be part of a um, community of uh, artists and burgeoning artists who are just discovering their uh, artistic uh, sides, so to speak. So I want to say hi to all of them. The uh, Thrive Hivers, ah, massive love to you as well. Thank you. You've been emboldening uh, me to take um, this new and sometimes scary step. So what we're doing the Songwriter's Corner is we're trying to open up a dialogue between us, the artists, and you, the audience. Not only... Um, well, one, it's so vital for us as the artists, it's such a vital tool to be able to communicate with the audience. Sometimes it's via the mediums themselves, music, acting. In this case, it's not only the music, but talking directly to you. We want to hear from you, especially if you're a songwriter as well. We would like to know what your process is, how you get to the finished products um, that you're so proud of, what leads you to write certain songs. Uh, and we would like to hear that as we share... Our process with you um, and encourage each other if you will so um, this song is not the song that I was working on uh, during that pick that I put out I am working on a song currently and uh, struggling a little bit with the verses I wasn't kidding when I said they were pesky uh, but this song is something I wrote a little while ago and I'm not gonna tell you I'm not gonna fully disclose where he came up with or what inspired the song but I will tell you the gist of the song which is basically, it's the gist of the song is about uh, when there is issues between two people that are unresolved. And it doesn't have to be a romantic two people. It could be friends, it could be family, relatives, or whatever. Um, but it's when issues are not resolved properly um, and there's never closure between these individuals. And one individual just thinks it's okay to go on with life basically act like that other individual doesn't even exist and just go off and live their lives and never the two shall meet, as they say. Um, and so um, I tried to figure out the right genre to put this in because it just didn't feel like a ballad and didn't feel like my usual pop stuff and didn't really feel like musical theater stuff that I've shared with you. So I gave it, I put it in the folk rock genre. And what we're going to do in this installment is I'm going to play you the song that I wrote. And then in the next installment, which I hope you'll please, please watch. Uh, in the next installment, or next episode of this installment of uh, the Songwriter's Corner, I'm going to play you the song that inspired um, the style of this song. Okay, so here we go. Without further ado, this song is called Better Left Unsaid. It goes something like this. For the longest time I tried to search my mind Try to figure out what I did wrong I was thinking I was the problem I was listening to the fear Never realized the problem Is that I'm, I'm simply here Oh, if I had my way If I had my say Wouldn't think things were better left unsaid Or hidden or forbidden Swept under a dusty bed I wish you'd turn around And face 
face the truth. So to throw and dirt, let's get to the root. But you're acting like this is all alright instead. Oh, I wish you didn't think things were better left unsaid. I wish you'd turn face the music, we should show some regret. Instead of acting like I don't exist or we never met. Pride stands in the way of making you whole. Something really bitter has darkened your soul. No, I ain't looking for your approval, I told you I wouldn't crawl. I just wanna know, I just wanna know, do you feel anything at all? If I had my way, if I had my say. I wouldn't think that things were left better left unsaid Or hidden or forbidden, pushed under a dusty bed I wish you'd turn around and face the truth Instead of throwing dirt, let's get to the root But you're acting like this is all okay instead I wish you didn't think yeah. Things were better left unsaid. I'd take an honest sorry, we can work this through. Instead of your thoughtless ways, and you acting like a fool. If I had my way, if I had my say, I wouldn't think things were better left unsaid. Or hidden or forbidden, swept under a dusty bed. I wish you'd turn around and face the truth Instead of throwing dirt, let's get to these roots But you're acting like this is all okay instead oh, I wish you didn't think Things were better left than said No, 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 I wish you didn't think Things were better left unsaid I wish you'd realize Some things just need to be said